Oh my god, ladies and gentlemen, we're back to not vampire, but house flipper. It's so good to see you, house flipper. If you've been following me for a while, you would know that I've been doing a let's play a vampire. I think we're on like let's play number 10 or something like that. And I figured, you know what, maybe you want to break from that and let's do some uh, good old fashioned house flipping. I don't know where we left off at with whatever house we were on, but um, we still got a lot of houses to go. That's for sure. Look at all these houses. I should do the alone house for like a Christmas special. So hopefully I can get done with all these houses by the time it's Christmas and then boom, drop the alone house. Classic. All right, let's do the, what's the name of this house? Variable, variable woman's house. I'm selling this house that I just bought because I changed my mind <laughs> and prefer to buy back my old house. I don't know anything about this house, but it looks good. You know what? I don't know anything about it either and I'm going to buy it. Let's see what we got around the house. A pretty, pretty solid, normal. Uh oh, you hear that? Those are the cockroaches. You hear the cockroaches? Pretty normal backyard. Nothing, nothing too fancy here. Oh my god, what type of shitty house is this? You come in, honey. I'm home. <laughs> Oh my God, what is this? <laughs> Honey, I'm home, I'm gonna, you're gonna use a sliding glass door. Oh my God. Oh my God. Well, this house is in really good condition too, by the way. What the, f what is this? Uh, oh, there's lots of cockroaches. Oh my God, this house is full of cockroaches. What is this? Oh my God. How many piles of cock? Oh my God. I've never seen so many cockroaches in my life. All right, let's get rid of some things, shall we? Boom. Uh, yeah, this is dumb. I'm pissed off. I'm pissed off. Hey, did you guys realize it's November already? What happened to October, huh? What happened to that long ass month of October, huh? I like to, uh, I like cleaning the windows because it is the most satisfying thing. And the, like every window in this house needs it. Damn, dude, this is a clean house with a lot of cockroaches. Boom, boom. All right, let's go kill these cockroaches. I take care of the cockroaches. I dare you to try to say cockroaches without saying cockroaches. Can't even do it. I heard you. I heard you try it. Didn't work out well. This is about to be a spick and span house. He's open. What the? 
Oh. Oh. Now, if you guys are just now realizing it is November, I got a funny story to tell you. Did I get one? No. So, daylight saving time is uh, November 1st. And uh, we were out and about. Me and my wife, uh, mind our own business, uh, doing things, get, getting done with errands. And all of a sudden, we, we have to meet someone at this location. We arrived there, and it was very strange that there was no one there. And we're like, oh, that's weird. We're like uh, right on time. They, they must have run late. That's unusual for them to run late. And our car had on the old time. And when then we looked at our phones and realized that, oh, wow, we are an hour early for uh, getting to this appointment. So it's really great. We really love that. I love daylight saving times. I can't wait for them to get rid of it needs to be thrown in the trash now I don't know if I can leave any of this uh, any of the furniture that's in here like I'm not sure if that devalues the house or they put it in here purposely because it saves you time on, on, on stuff I want to see what I can keep and what I can't keep Right now we're just giving a good sweep through. There's a lot of shit. Are you guys excited that I'm back doing this game? Did you miss this game? I honestly did. And there's going to be an update to this game. Uh, coming in like a month or so. Where it's going to be luxury homes. So now I could do twice, twice as big houses. Oh, look at that. We clean this house pretty fast. This is going to be the cleanest flip, cleanest, quickest flip ever. But yeah, there's going to be these huge luxury houses. Boom, baby. Don't need that. Oh, you need a place for your documents? How about you shove them up your butt? Got them. You see that? You know what's crazy to think about? Like, uh, people stress over what type of house they're gonna have or, or build or whatever it's gonna be. And, uh, it doesn't even work. And you can only really live in that house for like 30 years. 30, 20 years, and then you're done with it. It's kind of crazy. Like you spend so much money on this one thing and then 20 years down the line, it's meaningless. Like you don't need, you don't need the house anymore. Cause to the old folk home you go. It's not a sad thing. <laughs> Don't 
Don't you get all melancholy on me. Just the truth. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. I'm not, I ain't even have to second guess I'm taking all the walls down. Don't even got a second guess. It's in my blood. Oh my god. Much better. Boom, baby. Anybody else want some? Hmm? Okay, so how many bathrooms do we have? Do we count them? Let's see. One. Two. A three. No, just two. Okay. Do we need more than a two bath house? We could have a bathroom out here. But why would we have a bathroom right out here when there's one? Unless we could expand that one. Oh, now, now he's talking. It's kind of a small little, little area. What the hell is that? I mean, does it really need to be expanded? More living room area space, you know what I mean? Alright, let's tear down the walls, man. Okay, we need to tear down this wall. I got it. I'll take care of it. Alright. Uh, oh my god. That looks way better. Just that little weird piece right there. I'm all about the welcome, welcome home. We want to give these people the welcome home feeling. Don't you feel better? Don't you feel better already? You're like, welcome home. That's right. Um, get rid of this. I hate these lights. Let's get rid of those. What the hell are these? And uh, yeah, this place doesn't have a like a place to eat. What? What? Oh. Yeah, but this place to eat is like right next to the hangout area. Uh, don't need those. That's funny. Why don't you guys tell me that was there? Yeah. Santa Claus. Beautiful. Oh my god, look at that. Now I feel welcome home. Um I haven't played this game in a very long time, so I forgot where everything is. Floor. I also was playing The Sims on my Twitch stream, which if you really want to see a grown man struggle with a game, 
Go watch that. Cause your boy was struggling. I haven't played Sims since like Sims 1. I can see what you're trying to do here with these chairs. We'll keep these. I mean, that's a good setup. I like that. I can see what they're trying to do with the colors and stuff. There's no fridge or anything, so that's good. That's this whole thing. Okay. Um, dinner table will go right here. Bedroom numero uno can go right in here. Actually, let me get rid of this and... Usually those mirrors are on uh, only in horror movies, so we don't want those. Master bath is in here. And this is secondary bedroom. Okay, I can dig it. We gotta get rid of these because they don't work. And this is a uh, shower. I don't think I need that. We'll do the bathtub. So many doors. So we have a three bedroom, two bath house. Beautiful. Um, you know what guys? Don't like this. Uh, yeah, get rid of that. Cause you don't need a closet with a door. Don't let anyone ever tell you you need a closet with a door. Ah, much better. Much better. Okay, get rid of that. I like it. Look at that space. And then that goes right out to the patio. Oh, ho, ho, ho. very nice. Okay, I feel a lot more confident about this place. Um, so we're at 16 minutes. We want to keep this under 20. I am going to uh, update some things and I will come back to you in just a little bit. I want to give you uh, kind of a look real quick here at what I'm going to do. Let's do a pan. Oh yeah, look at that pan. This is how it looks now. Three bedroom, two bath pan. Yes, yes, oh yes. Oh yes. Okay, so I'll be right back. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to change some things add some furniture and make it look pretty and i'm back ladies and gentlemen oh no, i don't want you to see that oh let me hide that <laughs> i have a very special surprise in this house i tried to keep it pretty straightforward and clean um but of course i had to add a little flair to it so here is kitchen kept the counters added the oven stove fridge of course my shelves to please the gods Ceiling fans, of course. Actually, I can go over a little bit more. There we go. Look at this thing, though. Oh, fireplace, firewood, TV. Okay, got, got to avert your eyes. I don't want to show you this. Bedroom number one, kid's bedroom. Yeah, my bunk bed. Some nice little uh, beanbag things, which I don't call them that in this game. TV shelves, so please, God. Oh, don't look over there. Second bathroom. I don't know. Master bathroom. Gave it the sleepy blue. Two ceiling fans, because you know, you know. Bathroom. Did I not put a light in here? Hello? Oh dear. Pretend like you didn't hear or see anything like that. Um, there we go. And boom. There we go. Oh, that's so close to the shower. <laughs> this bedroom has three fans. <laughs> uh, guest bedroom or who knows what. Pretty basic bitch right here. 
And then a bathroom where the tub goes through the door. That is magic. That is known as a pure magic tub. And you guys ready for the, the final countdown? The final uh, secret surprise. Okay, I'm going to do the slow pan like I did earlier. Ready for this? Oh, oh there it is. Yeah, baby. The legendary dragon has graced himself upon this house. The legendary blue eyes white dragon. Attack 3000, defense 2500. Pretty strong defense for this house, I would say. And he's right in their humble abode. Wow, I am jealous. I am super jealous. This family, whoever buys this, lucked out. Wow. And of course there's pumpkins because you should know by now if you've watched any of these videos, I always submit for a crop test and I get a bunch of points from that, which I have no idea what that means. Uh, but it gives me a 20% increase on value, which who cares what that means. Then we put on auction to see what we can get. Oh, Cheng Chow. He hasn't popped up in a while. There's Jimmy Trader. Wow. We're attracting all sorts of folks for this one. They come for the blue eyes white dragon. Raphael. I'm not surprised at you. Let's just try to negotiate some for, for giggles. See what he says. Oh. Oh, beautiful. $104,000 profit. Okay, you guys ready for the pictures? Accept. Here we go, baby. Cockroaches everywhere. Cleaned them up. Old ass bed. Got rid of it. Weird bat bedroom. Cleaned it up. Living room. Added a fireplace. Kept the couches. Here's the big one. There he is. <laughs> Cut the grass. Add a bunch of pumpkins. There's the blue eyes. You can see him from the street. <laughs> oh, I love that I have that picture. Don't ask me how I have that picture, but uh, it's definitely a gem. Well, ladies and gentlemen, thanks so much for tuning in for another Carlisi Games. And uh, we'll be back with our Let's Play of Vampire soon. I just wanted to take a break from that and give you some quality house flipper content. So if you haven't, subscribed to the channel. If you like what you saw, give a comment, like, talk about the beautiful power of the Blue Eyes White Dragon. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.